Our chairman here present, our PSM president here present, our keynote address speaker here present, our real father here present, chairman board of fellows here present, our chairman and happen here present, our Past Chairman, Thomas Sobunide, here present. MD Nemeo from Pharmaceuticals, here present. Our fellows, DSA, our directors of pharmaceutical services, here present. Pharmacists, members of AHAPUN, our families and friends. Our new upcoming pharmacy students, you're welcome to the 25th Annual National Scientific Conference holding at Destiny Event Center, Tart, Coal City 2024. We join an immense gratitude to Almighty God. I welcome you all to Co City 2024. The theme of this conference, as we all know, is achieving universal health coverage, the role of hospital and administrative pharmacists. Universal health coverage means that all people have full access to the range of health care quality they need when and where they need them without financial hardship. It covers the entire continuum of essential health services. Each delivery requires health and health and care workers with an optimal skill mix at all levels of health systems who are equitably distributed, adequately supported with access to quality assured products. The important reason for introducing universal health coverage is to prevent financial hardship. The articulation of the roles of pharmacists in actualizing this goal is actually the theme of today's conference. This theme is art, and I know that our seasoned keynote address speaker and the sub team speakers we do justice to this topic. I want to welcome His Excellency Dr. Peter Ndubi Simba, the Executive Governor of Enugu State. I also want to welcome the Chairman and CEO of Juhel Nigeria Limited, a cheerful philanthropist who has accepted to chair this event. He's a, very state, he's a very important stakeholder in pharmacy and has epitomized this by his continued support for the profession's progress through selfless and sacrificial giving to the growth and advancement of the profession. We are very proud of you, Ide. You do great work to bridge the gaps. You cross the T's, you dot the I's, and you will ensure the successful completion of projects for humanity. I want to tell you that almost all the schools in the Southeast, apart from UNN, our chairman has a hand in ensuring full accreditation in a pharmacy project. Though he is not a beneficiary and has even no intention of training his children in these schools, he ensured that this region continue to produce qualified pharmacists to meet the country's growing needs. We pray that the Almighty God, who sees you in secret, sir, will reward you openly. You're highly welcome, sir. I crave your honor and undivided attention as we listen to our highly celebrated speaker, Professor Charles Esimone the former Vice-Chancellor of Namdiaz Kiwe University, 
This transformative Vice Chancellor is our keynote address speaker. Welcome, sir. We thank you for accepting to perform the task. We also thank you for coming in person. I know how difficult it is to travel these days. As you can see, some of the things plaguing our gathering here has to do with the situation of the era, but you still made time to come. You obliged us with your presence despite your hectic schedule. We know you prepared for us, so let us all learn from him. To our self-team speakers and traditional rulers here, most especially His Royal Highness Barista J.U. Naji, as a Odezilimo III of Nike Kingdom. All our distinguished ladies and gentlemen, my representative of PCN, PS, PCN Registrar here present, Pharmacist Thomas Lupetu, we thank you all for gracing the occasion. During your visit here, we'll take you to various story sites here in Enugu. We'll have the smart schools, we'll have the type two centers, we have the pine forest at Ngo. We also look forward that you enjoy the range of our foods, the food we have here, our achicha, unkobi, ofako, obaka, and other traditional cuisines, too numerous to mention. Finally, I want to thank the conference planning committees, members of the LOC, our indefatigable and amiable, very energetic state, I have one chairman from Teresa, Dr. Chinelo and Pharmacist Morin for all the efforts we have put in making this conference a success. We gather here to learn, to network and relax. May God in his mercies be with us throughout this occasion and grant us all journey mercies back to our various homes. We welcome you all to Enugu State. We welcome you all to the Coal City, to the old fortune and to the land whose tomorrow is here. Thank you and God bless you. Hospital and Initiative Pharmacy Association Conference has been quite a test of resonance, of tenacity, of the spirit of can do of the average Nigerian pharmacist. I must say that we went against all odds to ensure that, in spite of the challenges around that people came and the conference was held. I mean, it's going on now. So we are very grateful to the Almighty God. All glory goes to Him. Because everything that surrounds the whole thing, the favors we've had from CEO, um, from CEO uh, publications and media outfits, the, the uh, 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 sponsorship we had from pharmaceutical companies, sponsorship we had from you know colleagues and then people that came from all walks of life within the particular chairman and secretary of uh, national have had wonderful people make it a success and also the LOC I'm just overwhelmed at uh, what God can do and for the fact that we braved the situation we braved the condition the country was in to ensure that it holds we just give God the glory for everything.